the 72 returned with, with joy and said, Lord, when we went out for mission, demons submit to us in your name. Now, there was a group of 72 people that were sent to the places that where Jesus desired to go. There are places when, where Jesus desired to go. But instead of going there, he sent representatives. And I want you to understand this. As a child of God in Christ Jesus, you are a representative of Jesus in that environment. There is a devil that is in that environment. And I want to let you know that Jesus has already given you authority over that devil. You need to take your position. You need to take your position. The position of defense and the position of attack. In the spiritual realm, we have defense and we have attack. Even in the boxing match, there is defense mechanisms and there is attack mechanisms. In every battle, in every war, there is defense and there is attack. I want to let you know, viewer, God has given you that dominion and spiritual authority to destroy that yoke, to destroy that bondage, to destroy that witch, to destroy that sorcerer, to destroy that keeper of demon, to destroy that situation that has been moving around in your father's house, in your mother's house. God has given you a spiritual mandate to be a family deliverer. Hallelujah. You are a family deliverer. You carry a portion of the anointing of God. That's why you hear me emphasizing each and every day. Fear not, because you have the anointing. You have the power. You have the grace. Hallelujah. Precious people of God, I want to let you know that today, this is the hour that the Lord has made. This is the hour that the Lord has made for your freedom in the name of Jesus Christ. This is the hour that the Lord has made to set you free, to deliver you in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, if you continue reading the Bible in the book of Rook chapter number 10, verse number 17, the demons were subject to us in your name. Verse number 18. He replied, I saw Satan fall like lightning from heaven. When they exercised the spiritual dominion and authority, the Bible says that Satan fell like lightning from that spiritual environment that he, he, he was. In deliverance ministry, we call it the throne of Satan in the spiritual realm. In deliverance ministry, we call it the throne of Satan in the spiritual realm. But we have been given authority to pull him down. There are people you are watching at this hour. God wants you to exercise spiritual authority. God wants to, you to exercise spiritual dominion. So that you can pull down that throne of Satan that has been operating against the spiritual realm of your family. When the, when the satanic throne is over your family, you'll be experiencing bad things, bad situations, disappointment, setbacks, unexplainable sicknesses unexplainable attacks. But God has given us spiritual authority to pull down every satanic throne that has been operating over our spiritual environment in the name of Jesus Christ. Child of God, begin to make a prayer in this dominion prayer moment. Begin to make a prayer in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, in the name of Jesus, in this moment of